Hello everybody, Derek here from Addictive Tips, and in this video we're going to be talking about how to back up your Mate desktop. So before I start, I'm going to let you know we're only going to be covering how to make the backup, the main backup. We're not going to be covering on how to restore it or how to back up the icons. That is all stuff you're going to have to check out in the article below because it's just too much stuff. And uh, the main concept of this article and this demonstration is to talk about how to make the backup. That's the meat of it. So let's get started. So because Mate is a GTK desktop, it defines a lot of its settings in the dconf system. There's a tool called dconf editor that may be installed on your system and we cover how to get that installed if you don't have it, but um, we're not going to be using the dconf editor. We're going to be using the command line, but the thing is, is we need to understand how this all works. So if you go into the Mate section, you can see everything is is defined here. The panel settings, how it looks, you know, the desktop itself, the everything is defined here. So this is how you can create a backup of your core settings. And when I say core settings, I mean like how my desktop looks now, where the, you know, where the shortcuts are and the wallpaper and all of that. So let's go ahead and look for the terminal. And, uh, then what you do is you do dconf dump org mate and then we dump it to a file and let's put it on the desktop. So right now I'm dumping just the mate settings. So if we go back into the dconf editor, we are only backing up what's in here in this folder right here. So to do a backup, you're going to need to do this command here and this is a core backup we're not going to worry about the other stuff in this first backup we will do a full backup for everything in dconf and everything possible here but this is just the main stuff you have to make sure you write this exactly the way it is or it's not going to work now once we dump that we can open up with the text editor and we can see all of our settings the metadata the background color and all of that everything looks the way it was set up now and then if we import it later from our backup we can use it so that's a f that's a, a core backup if you want to do a full backup if you want to back up everything that dconf has to offer you can change the command to just a forward slash and then type in full backup now this is going to dump everything at all in dconf everything every little thing that you would ever have in here is going to be there and uh, so as you can see, app slash locker, and you've got different folders and different settings. So it backs up quite a lot of stuff. And uh, that's how that works. So that is how to back up your desktop settings for Mate. I am going to quickly show you how to restore the core backups Again, we're not talking about how to restore the icons and all the other things because that is what the article is for and you should check that out below and do further reading on this because that kind of stuff really is something you got to read and understand. But for this, installing a backup like we've got here is about as easy as dconf load and then we do the same section. So we'll do the full backup first and we'll do the sign instead of the other one. Point it to our backup which is on the desktop and then full backup and that's going to load in our settings and if we want to do the mate backup we do org slash mate and slash because that's important type in mate and that will load in and then our settings are there so if we had lost anything or if we had reinstalled and things look different we wanted to restore our, our desktop backups that's what you would do. Anyways, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video, and I will see you in the next one.